What is up, everyone? We are back again with some more Tears of the Kingdom. We are here in Garuda Town. We just got done doing the Lightning Temple. And now, the next main mission to do is to head back to Lookout Landing. Uh, now that we've cleared out all the... the temples. I believe it should be all the temples. That's what they want us to do. But before we actually do that, what we're going to do today is we're going to be exploring all of Gerudo Town. And hopefully completing all the quests for Gerudo Town as well. So now that everything is cleared up here, it seems like the town is just in general more lively. So I would assume that, yeah, so before no one was even up here and now everyone's back on the surface, right? They were hiding below the ground and now everyone's up here like normal again. So I'm just going to start from the beginning, see if we find any side quests. Hey, look who we got here. Oh, Link, I see you journeyed here as well. Our investigation of the geoglyphs has brought us to Gerudo Town. The thing is, no vo allowed. That's what they said as they stubbornly denied me entrance. Lady Impa is in town gathering information right now. That means there's nothing to do for me. There's nothing for me to do but while, but while away the hours guarding our balloon. Can't believe I was forced to leave Lady Impa's side. How mortifying that I can't fulfill my duty of protecting her. Oh, Lady Impa, please come back soon. How devastating that is. So, we'll find her in here somewhere. Go ahead and start with the right side, and there we go, our first quest. Sama. Ah, it's the special bow. Hey, look at this. Hi. Isn't this orb great? After the sand shrewd went away, I came outside and found it lying right here. Mama says it's weird. But you agree it's cute, right? My very own treasure. Yeah. Huh? No way. Finders keepers. It takes a special bow though to see what a special orb this is. Aww. If you like it that much, I guess I could lend it to you. On one condition. You gotta play with, I mean, challenge me for it. Beat me and it's yours. So, are you ready for a game? Yeah. That's what I like to hear. We can't face off here. Let's go to the shelter. Alright, let's see what kind of game she's talking about. Ah. Here we are. Everybody's gone back to the surface, but I get to get used to the shelter as my own playground. Here's the game. I'm gonna hide a stuffed sand seal doll somewhere here. Yeah. If you find it before time runs out, you win. Okay, now close your eyes for a minute while I hide it. Aww. Where should I hide it? Gotta pick a spot fast. Huh? Does this stuff belong to the soldiers? Gotta brace myself and push. Okay, you can open your eyes now. <laughs> Found the perfect hiding spot. Good luck figuring out where I put the stuffed sand seal doll. Are you, re are you ready to go? And start. Alright, so it has to do something with soldiers. I have a minute and a half. Oh man. Um. I feel like I do remember there being something about like soldiers. She following me? Maybe here? Somewhere? Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, you found it. Good job. You win. See you back at the entrance to the shelter, okay? Wow, how'd you find it? I'll lend you the orb now, just like I promised, so you can play with it as much as you want. <laughs> that game was so much fun. It reminds me of something Miss 
A shy told me. If there's a vo, I have a, if there's a vo, I have fun hanging out with. Then there's a very special vo in D. Huh? See, I knew right from the start that you were a special vo. Let's play together again sometime. All right. That was pretty easy. Okay, so now head back out. So now we can take this orb and I, I guess what, let's take it inside? go ahead and put this orb in that one room. Where was that room though? Was it here somewhere? No. In here perhaps? I like place it in here, like on this thing. Ooh, yeah, that's definitely it. So I'll have to find all the orbs that go here. Very cool. Very interesting. And yeah, we'll keep going. And then we'll. <laughs> this is also something that we can do. We have to come in the evening. Oh well, it's almost evening, so maybe we'll stop by here in a second. Mm -hmm. Hi. Okay everyone, pay attention. Today we're going to have a very special lesson. We have a bow here with us. <laughs> Try to relax and be your regular, normal selves when you're talking to him. Alright. Oh. Nali, I know you can do this. Teacher, I, I, I can't. Can't look directly at his face. Oh. That's okay. We can stop here for now. Mm -hmm. We will have to do something about that fear eventually. But I think once you muster the courage to face a bow, even just one time, your fear will wash away forever. What is this? <laughs> <sighs> I'm sorry. I imagine that that was a bit unexpected, wasn't it? See, she's never seen a bow in person. She's only seen them in drawings or in recreations like the bow dummies. Um, Waggy Pants Granny. What's up, man? Um, so, yeah, it's going good. I've already, I just did the Lightning Temple. So now I'm just kind of exploring uh, Gerudo Town post-Lightning Temple. Mm. I suspect that if you hid your face, it would be easier. Probably just too early to make, your, make eye contact with chatting. Hope you aren't feeling discouraged, though. It would be wonderful if you visited class again. <laughs> like so for taking the time today. Wait, so they're saying hide my face. I hide my face with like anything? Like one of these? Let's try. Let's try one more time. Hi. <laughs> oh. Okay, so now she's like, hey, I can talk to him like this. So, hi, my name is Nolly. I make an amazing wild berry creep crep, and I hope to share one I've made with a bow someday. Oh. Alright, that's enough. Ma. Amazing job, Nolly. Bow are known to think their stomachs sometimes. To think with their stomachs sometimes. Mentioning your cooking was a good idea. They're especially sus susceptible to sweets. So well done with the wildberry crap. Oh. Like dark so to you as well. It was very kind of you to conceal your face for Nali. Seems like 
That's just the thing he needed to get past her anxiety and talk to you. <laughs> you are more than welcome to return to this class in the future. Mm -hmm. Will it be the same thing? Hi. <laughs> Different oh. person. Ratana. Um, Pratana? Frozen. I can't do it. I think I need that drink from the canteen to give me energy. Hmm. This is noble pursuit. You're offering it to me? Do you, do you go to canteens a lot? I mean, they have wonderful drinks there. But that isn't all, you know? It's a great place to relax. You get to meet all kinds of people. Mm. I love going there. I have so many fun stories. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and stop there. It's wonderful when Evo and I and Evi communicate their needs to one another. Oh. Even better when they can do it on an unspoken level. Mm. Ratana, I think you've got a lot of potential. This is so funny. <laughs> Alright, we got one more person to go, I think. Tell time. Show us what you know. <sighs> There's no reason for me to practice. I've been abandoned by love, by luck, by happiness. You're only setting yourself up for disaster by talking with someone like me. <sighs> Just fated to be unhappy. You're clear or you'll catch my misfortune. Mm. Beltan, you're your own worst enemy sometimes. I've told you already that every time you sigh, you push your own happiness away. Hmm. I know you say that, but oh. you're gonna stop the lesson for now, I think. Beltan, I really do believe that when you find your confidence again, things will look a li little better to you. Huh. Interesting. Mm -hmm. This lesson w was a bit tough. Deltan is still feeling the pain from her last relationship. It's really taking a toll. I wish there was something I could show her to help. Mm -hmm. You know, she mentioned a certain accessory that would help her connect with others. But those only come from the village in Nekluda off the east. That's not exactly convenient. Nekluda? So like the... Let's see. This? Like, like the gear from the Ritos? I mean, I think that's my best bet right now. So let's try it one more time like this, and if it doesn't work, then I mean, that, that'll be it. Not sure what she's talking about then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So maybe we'll look into that a little bit later. Not really sure what she's talking about at all. Oh look, there's another one of these. Go ahead and take this and bring it where we need to take it. There we go. Alright, so this one is like the arrow looking thing. So this one will go up here. Now that I think about it, See what's down here. Yeah, I, um, let me check out what's over here. The Valley of Silent Statues. Oh, uh, we were actually coming this way at one point. Oh, what is that? Is 
Riju Vo, Riju Vo has granted you the power to summon her avatar. Nice. We did not keep advancing though after this. Ooh, some diamond. Keep heading up. Okay, so this is just another way of getting over here. And we are freezing, so let's go ahead and change our clothes. So this is where Riju was originally. We had to come out here for her. So I guess let me go ahead and finish exploring here. Just to see if there's anything. Here we got this. Gerudo Sanctuary. going of course we got these guys Uh, is this a restart? No, this is actually still my first playthrough. I know, right? It's been months since this game has come out, but yeah, this is actually still my first playthrough. The game is just so big that I've kind of taken my time with it, you could say. So, I mean, if you have any tips, go ahead and drop any tips that you think I might be missing out on. So we got this, we got, I see a chest here. Oh, you're on your first playthrough day one? Yeah, you got a long way to go. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I wonder if we can knock this down. No, it doesn't seem like it. But maybe, let's just go ahead and come up through here.
Oh. But yeah, this seems like it might be a dead end. Actually, no. You have something here. Oh, it seems like we need some some type of uh, orb here. Hmm. Did I miss it or did I keep going forward to try to find it? probably be this way, right? Northern eyes. Oh, we got another side quest here. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're a Hylian. A sock. This is the ice house. It's where we store ice, obviously. It's all made from snow melt from the Gerudo Highlands. I'm kind of surprised to see you here. It isn't really a tourist destination. <sighs> but you're probably wondering where all the ice is, right? Well, it's gotten hot. Enough that it's all melted. Feels wrong to even call this place an ice house right now. Mm. Have you heard about the incredibly popular drink the noble canteen in town makes? Will it use its ice from here? Or it did. If I can't get ice delivered to town, there won't be any signature drinks being made by anyone. Gotta find a way to make ice. So. Question, I guess, from here would be... Do I just make this into ice for her? Using like ice fruit. Yeah. Oh. Hey, that's ice, isn't it? I didn't know Hylians could make ice. Maybe I've been in the ice house or up the mountain for too long. Anyway, if it's okay with you, could I have this ice? It's possible to make a hunk of ice that fits nicely in that clove. That would be ideal. I gotta now I gotta melt it. Oh. That should be good. Right? Does that work or no? Oh. Hmm. What happened? Oh. Hey wait, ice. Oh hey, perfectly sized ice. This will definitely hold up in the trip to town. That's great. Oh. Sark. Hopefully this is something you can make use of. Be sure to grab something to drink at the canteen in town. Oh. Feel free to come back and make more ice, okay? Uh, but don't... But I don't have anything I can give you as a reward right now. It wouldn't feel right to accept your help when I can't repay you. Give me some time, okay? You could always visit the spa in Gerudo Town in the meantime. In the mean- oh wait. You're a bow, so you aren't allowed inside Gerudo Town. Maybe you could relax at Kara Kara Bazaar instead? Alright, there we go. Let's see what's above here. Korok seed. I didn't find that orb that I was looking for. So I'm just wondering if I missed it somewhere. 
Hell. No, I don't see anything, so. Let's just go ahead and head back. Unfortunately, we came up empty handed. Seemed like I needed some type of orb to get it. To get in. Alright, let's keep looking here and see what's going on. So, I think I was like around here. There we go. Another quest right here. I heard there's a place out in the desert with huge statues that are all facing each other. Have any of your customers ever mentioned seeing something like that while they're surfing the dunes? Hmm. Hard to say. The desert has its share of statues and ruins. And of course, the upheaval really changed things too. Do you have any more information to go on? Maybe a map or something? I did have one, but the wind caught it and blew it off to who knows where. I know for sure that it's in the eastern part of the desert though, and I, and like I said, the huge statues face each other. Mm. It helps to know it's in the east, but well, the desert is really really big. <gasps> ah, a customer. Sorry, I need to get back to work. If you figure out where you need to go, come back and see me. I'll be happy to rent a sand seal to you for your trip. For the trip. So, it sounds like we got some place east of the desert. Yeah, I mean, the desert is huge, like he said, so <laughs> we got a lot of east to, to search. Maybe just like around this area, maybe. So let's go ahead and rent one and then we'll head over to where I think we need to go. Okay. So one, let's go ahead and... Mark that. Oh, okay, so it doesn't even mark it where we need to go. So I think it should be like around this area. So I'll at least put that marker. Hi. So we have some idea of where to head to. Hi. So unfortunately, I'm going to go back. Let me go back. Okay. Let's go see if we can talk to her. Maybe that's where I messed up. Saba. Hey, you. You look like you're done your fair share of exploring. Have you ever seen a massive... Have you ever seen massive ruins with huge statues facing each other? Be the eastern part of the desert, I think. I lost my map, so I don't know exactly where they are. Does that sound familiar? If you know what I'm talking about, I'd appreciate it if you could take me there on a play seal. Oh wow. <laughs> Exploration expenses were paid in advance, so I'd obviously reward you if you helped me. Eh? Wow. <laughs> I was supposed to talk to her.
Well, I wasted 20 rupees right there. Try this again. Let's go ahead and get her on. Okay. Maybe she'll give me like some type of hints or something. I don't understand what's going on. <sighs> that was close. Oh, I mean, try that again. Oh no, 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 no. Back. I need to get her on again. <laughs> I think I'm looking in the wrong area. I'm totally looking in the wrong area. <laughs> this way, I, I can't believe I made that mistake. I was literally going west, not east. Where I went that way, I don't know if I should actually go that way again. Um, let me see what's going on here. Hey, okay, finally. I was going to say, what is going on? <laughs> Stop here. Hey, look at that. Huge statues. They're facing each other. There's another statue, right? Falling over? Okay, I'm sure this is the place I was asked to investigate. Dark. Now that I'm here, I can really start my investigation. Oh, and of course, I have to reward you for your help. <laughs> I can tell right away that this place will be worth a really thorough look. Got my work cut out for me. Already interesting, Rotana said that there were supposed to be ruins of, of the seven heroines here. So where have the other two gone? We did it. Gosh, that took way too long. I gotta say. I think I saw something here, so I might as well go for it.
There you go. Yeah, we're probably gonna end it here shortly. Done a good amount. Man, am I gonna make this? And not. Unless I can, like... Oh man, I was pretty close too. Okay. Go ahead and head back. hard to say what's all here because it seems like there's a lot like over here too whatever this is whatever this is <laughs> but we're, well i'll try to mainly stick with gerudo town if something takes me over there then i'll do that too oh. sounds like the monsters are all gone now perda so do you move that crate away from the door Oh. oh, of course. Sorry, let me move it now. Easy as. Hmm? What's the matter, Perda? <sighs> my my back. No. What? No, no, no. You know I can't lift that myself. What are we going to do? Customers won't be able to get in if we can't unblock the door. Uh-oh. I got an idea, though. So oh, actually this is pretty this is definitely a quest right here. Okay, come on. Hold up. This is definitely a quest right here because what this is is Perda is the wife of the guy that's in in jail right now. We gotta find a way to get her out of here. Wait, will you look at this guy? What's this person doing? Oh. If you're too loud, the guards might find us. Plus, it makes it hard to hear the voices coming from below. I'm thinking about his secret. Ah, okay. So this is just like telling us, letting us know that there's someone here. Can I get in this way? We cannot. So yeah, so I'm just guessing we have to just come from above. I mean, from below. Maybe right here? Oh god. Uh, I guess that wasn't a good idea. Let's see where this leads us. I, f I have a feeling this could lead us to where we're trying to go. I thought I marked it. Didn't I mark it? It was like... Alright, let's just keep going.
Let's just try going up here. I think I did it. Client list, check. Products, check. Hmm. A bow. But the door's blocked. How did you... Never mind. It's our rule not to pry into the business of our customers. You're welcome in our shop, no matter how you manage to make it inside. Oh. This is the Gerudo Secret Club. The only shop in town that sells clothing designed with Vo in mind. Considering Vo aren't allowed in town, I'm sure you can understand why the shop is a secret. Anyway, that's how we run our business. We're not concerned with who you are. As an outcast myself, I appreciate your business. Vasak. Oh. I was not expecting a bow to suddenly appear right before my eyes. It nearly made me jump out of my skin. I should thank you though. I had a crick in my back, but the shock of your arrival seems to have fixed it. <laughs> my husband is a Hylian bow too. Imagine if he'd been the one suddenly appearing. But obviously he isn't allowed into town. Since it is a customer since it is customary for Gerudo to return to town at a certain age, our daughter and I moved back here. Mm. I warned my husband several times that Bo are not allowed inside the town and were sometimes jailed, but well, he insisted on traveling with us all the way here, and I saw him eyeing the town walls and we parted ways. Wabin, I wonder what you're up to right now. <sighs> anyway, once you're done shopping, you'd better get out of town before any of the guards catch you. Lady, your husband is in jail. Alright, this is pretty cool gear. I don't got any money to, to actually do anything about it. So, I mean, shouldn't I be able to tell her about her husband? Uh. I don't get it. I'm gonna mark it just in case. I feel like I should be able to tell her about her husband that's in jail so that she can go get him out. Link, glad to see you. Have you been to Lookout Landing yet? Send Valeria there. If you find her, stay high for me, okay? Mm. I haven't gotten any new information about Zelda. I think she's been he around here recently. Don't know if you'll find this information helpful, but mm. after I become a sage, after I became a sage and returned to town, I discovered an interesting ancient reference. Seek out the swordsman, swordswoman upon the sand. Look to where she points. There is a tre treasure waiting underground. That was written in an old document I discovered. Mm. I doubt it holds any connection to Zelda. But it might be a clue to something. The swordswoman upon the sand. Treasure underground. It could be worth looking into. I honestly think I know what she's talking about. Okay, I'm just gonna check. I know there's a couple things that I can do, and I think it's called Kara Kara Bazaar. I'm pretty sure I can go there and bring the orb that the, the guy had an orb there, and we can bring it back here. So I'm gonna check that out. So I'm gonna go ahead and just teleport over there. here. Let's see if we can find that, that guy. Not even the guy, just the orb itself. Oh yeah, here it is. Young man, please, 
Have you seen a fellow with a scruffy beard around here? Uh. Sorry, that was rather abrupt. But just our friend, Pontos. He's gone missing. When Karakara Bazaar was attacked by monsters, we ran away together, taking shelter at the local inn. But when I finally, but when I finally had my wits about me, I realized Pontos had disappeared. Be born, how you doing, bro? <laughs> Between the storm sands and the rush of people, everything was a chaotic blur. I could barely see a thing. But I think I caught a glimpse of Panthos running out there, out out through the west entrance. <sighs> For lost in the desert, our squad's rule is to wait for rescue in a place that stands out, like near a tall building. But with all the sinkholes in the desert, it's easy to get tripped up. And I'd rather not find out what would happen if I fell in one. Lost in the dunes. Teach you how to play this game? Ooh, you got a long way to go. <laughs> Streaming pro clubs? Dude, that would be hilarious. I'd be down though. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's not for sale. Truth be told, it's kind of a nuisance, so I'd love to give it to you. But its owner is currently missing. If you'd like it, how about making a deal with him when we when he comes back? So, it seems like this ball, that this orb that we need, the only way we can actually get it is by completing this quest. So it's the Lost in the Dunes. Pontos, a bushy bearded ca caravan. Tr Traveler went out through the west entrance and hasn't returned yet. Standard caravan practice to wait in a conspicuous location near a tall structure, for example, when lost in the desert. But since a sinkhole is also in this area, finding Pontos isn't going to be easy. Alright, so. I don't know how we're gonna find him, but. Let's go ahead. I wonder if we can. Let's see here. How are we gonna? We we need one of those like sand, steel thingies. I thought I saw one, but I don't see it anymore. I'm just gonna get on here and see if I can scope out the area. Oh yeah, right here. We can get on this thing. Pretty sure. Gotta sneak up on it. There we go. Alright, so. A conspicuous location near a tall structure. So let's just, I would say, let's just look everywhere that seems like a tall structure. Hi. That makes sense to me. Oh, wait. Ah. Let's wait right here, actually. Let's wait right here. So if I go in there, do I die? He wouldn't be in there, right? That wouldn't make sense. Alright, let's get back on this thing. Keep going. Oh, it's leaving me. Right, I gotta sneak up on it. I have no idea. I'm just gonna jump in here and see what happens. Does it take me somewhere or do I just respawn? Aha! There we go! Dang, gotta trust your gut sometimes. I messed up. What? A person? 
Excuse. Sorry. Never thought I'd run into another person down here. Well, Danny Sinkle, cool, did you? So did I, my guy. My name's Ponthos. I'm a member of a, of a caravan squad. Where I was before monsters attacked the oasis. I ditched my friends and ran. That's how I wound up down here. Ah. Looked all over the place, but I still can't find an exit. You and me might, might be down here for a long, long time. Alright. So we did the hard part, I think, which was finding him. Now we just gotta bust him out. And ourselves. Of stone here. <laughs> Just smash my way in there. That's it? There should have been some like diamond in there or something. <laughs> My goodness, this is taking forever. There we go. Dang, seems like we got a bunch of options. Wonder if I can just use his ability. Yeah, there we go. That speeds up some of the process. So it sounds like over here it's gonna be the Bubble Frog. You already know, T born. <laughs> Alright, so at least that way just loops around. We don't have to travel too far. Uh, let's see what's over here. We just got some... Yeah, nothing really over here. Alright, this seems like the correct way to go. Let me just check what was over here on this side too. Bunch of shrooms over here. Let's go let's, this way then. Seems like this is the exit. Yep, there we go. No way. I thought I heard some kind of commotion. Look at that. We've got a path out of out of here. Did you do all this, my guy? You gotta tell me. How did you pull this off? 
I bet we can climb that ladder up to the surface. Ooh. Thank you so much. I better hurry back. I'm sure my friends are worried sick. Oh, but I still want to give you a proper reward. Drop by Kara Kara Bazaar when you get a chance. Alright, there we go. Let's see where this actually takes us out of. We're at Karakara Bazaar. I wonder... That's interesting. So we could have technically gone that way if we would have known about it, but... I mean, there's no way that we would have known. Ah. This young man saved your life. We all owe him for that. Though no matter how many times I hear it, I still can't believe anyone survived into falling into a sinkhole. As the leader of the caravan squad, allow me to thank you for bringing Pantos back to us. Oh. As a reward? <laughs> How about this orb, my guy? It has a weird pattern on it, and it's probably rare, right? Whatever it is, you know it's cool. Trust me, I'm a merchant. I've got an eye for things like this. Hmm. Uh, when am I streaming again? Probably Wednesday, like around the same time, 4.35. PST. <laughs> I know someone in Gerudo Town is on the lookout for my for stuff like this. So I was going to see if they could appraise it. I'll let you have it, my guy. It's the rarest thing I've got, and it's all yours. Take good care of it. Alright, cool. We got it. But now we just gotta take it over there. How far is it? That's pretty far. There has to be a way of doing it. Love you too, bro. Take, take care. Peace. Alright. While we're here also, let's see... Actually, there's probably not much to do here. Alright, let's try this. Yeah, there we go. I bet we could even still attach the little wagon. Or not wagon. I don't know why I said wagon. The little fan. To get that extra boost or something. And we have made it. I'm like thinking about it and I'm wondering if this is even faster than actually just walking with orb itself that was not moving fast at all I wonder if I what happens if I bring this to her oh yeah I guess I was supposed to bring it to her I don't I'll wait Oh, she's talking about those things. I forgot that. I thought she was talking about the orbs. Let me see what she's actually got to say. Let's find four more stelae. Seven heroines protect the Gerudo with the powers of heart, skill, fortitude, wisdom, flight, mobility, and compassion. Hmm, yes. This legend is well known, but it had never been verified. Till I came along. I'm curious about what might be written on this on the Staley. No, 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 that's not how you say it. Delay? You don't have more to show me, do you? Eh? Only three more. Do I, have, do I have more pictures for her? Ah. And what did she say? Ah. No. <laughs> mm. have to find three of them. It's possible they were destroyed or altered when the town was constructed. Hmm. I wish I could see that. See the text inscribed on those stilly. Or even just a picture. Oh, let's 
let's see. I believe it's this way. Is it, what is this? This is like a... It's like a heart looking thing. This belongs here. So I guess that's something that we still have to do also. We have to go ahead and look for these things. Uh, so I guess we can do that now. I haven't- I don't know if I've actually been looking for those in town, so... Let's actively look for those. Is this not one? I don't get it. Oh, I have to... I see now. I have to recreate it. Here's the next one, but it's the kid class and we can't actually go there yet. Alright, here it is. Why can't I move this? It doesn't want me to move it, but instead take a picture like this. I had it. I had it again. Alright. So that's... I, I just need one more, I believe. And it's definitely this one. The one in the jail. Oh, I wonder if I don't even have to get in there. I almost wonder if I all I need to do is just get on this and then try to take a picture of it. <laughs> oh man, I have no idea if this is correct at all. see this. First, take a picture. What? How long have you been in here? Wait, I recognize you. I've seen you walking around out there. I don't understand. You're a man, but they let you just come here, come and go whenever you like? No secret that the Gerudo regularly enforce their their law that forbids men from entering the town. So, how come you're able to just walk around without causing a fuss? I mean, mm. I barely crossed the threshold between town and desert. They threw me in jail faster than I could say, no wait, not jail. They didn't give me a chance to explain anything at all. I just wanted to see the face of my wife, Berta, and our daughter, Ekla. But... And I'm only telling you this because you seem like a trustworthy, trustworthy sort. I've actually seen my daughter a few times. So on average, I'm more happy than upset. Oh. Even though they have me in this jail, I do see her occasionally. However, I haven't seen my wife even once. I know she was planning to work at a clothing store in Gerudo Town. But that's all I've got. I'm sure my daughter could tell me more, but I haven't been able to talk to her yet. Herda Akla... I know we'll be together soon. Let's just walk out the front door. No. How do you get in there? 
The Thomas City Jail Cell, 90 place for visitors. Only prisoners are supposed to be in there, like that bow who tried to get into town. But you, you're the chief's guest, aren't you? The fact that you, you got in there, on purpose or by accident, without me knowing would be embarrassing, so... Get out of there before anyone sees you, come on. Alright, well... I don't know, can we get him out of jail or not? I have no idea. All I know is that we got everything that we needed. Let's see. It says, The seven heroines who protect the Gerudo, their power is tied within the seven spirits. Curious. Does this mean that seven heroines' powers have changed form, even now that they're, they are gone? And what could be meant by spirits? What if spirits refers to orbs like this one? I believe I've made a breakthrough. Hmm. I'm curious about what might be written on the staley. Delay. You don't have more to show me, do you? Well, actually... Hmm. What does this one say? Let's see. Seven heroines who protect the Gerudo. Their spirits rest within the land of, of the Gerudo. Hmm. So the spirits of the seven heroines are hidden within the Gerudo region. Affirming that these spirits are not legend or rumor, but real, is by itself an enormous breakthrough. Ah. I'm curious about the text inscribed on the st stele. Stele. You perhaps find any? Last one. Mm. Let's see. It says, the seven heroines who protect the Gerudo, when their powers return to them, the Shrouded Eighth will be known. Mm. The seven heroines power return, we can meet the Shrouded Eighth. But that must mean it really was an eighth heroine. I don't believe it. This changes everything. Ah. We did it. We know that all of the stele is delay say. Now to put it all together. Mm. The eighth of them connects the other seven powers. Art, skill, fortitude, wisdom. Light, mobility, and compassion. We have to return the seven heroine spirits to them to meet the, this eighth. Those spirits are all hidden within the Gerudo region. That should about sum it up, right? Ah. It occurs to me that there were similar drawings on the stele too. Stele. I think this orb must be one of those spirits that houses the seven heroines' powers. You know, deep inside the eastern area of this of the shelter, there is a place with statues of the seven heroines. Mm. Those statues, I remember them looking as if they could hold something. Maybe we could try placing the orbs in their arms. But to do that, we'll have to recover the other six orbs, wherever they are. <laughs> the joys of archaeology, as soon as you solve one mystery, another emerges to take its place. But I'm not deterred. I'll get to the bottom of each and every one. And you? Without you, I could not have deci deciphered the stele. I hope you help me uncover the truth of the heroines. You should keep this orb. You're free to use it whenever you want. Eh? And take this too. Hey, how's it going, Michael? Ah. After all your help with my research, it is the least I owe you. There are more mysteries waiting for us down here. I know it. My scholarly spirit is soaring. <laughs> There we go. We did that one. Now let's go drop this off. So what is this? This is like a... Almost like a number six or number nine, whichever. Hmm. Oh, did you come here to do your own research? I see that the orb I gave you earlier is here now. Which means you must have carried it from here for me. Nice work. Bow have their uses, eh? And that's not the only orb you brought, I see. This is a big help. Dark so. That must have been hard, huh? Here, let me reward you. Ellen, really? <laughs> so you already tried placing an orb on the, a heroine statue? But according to you, nothing happened. The shape has me convinced that they belong to the, in the statue's arms. Guess we'll have to return all the or return 
the orbs to all of seven of the heroines before we know. But this means we're, on, we're one step closer to the truth about our mysterious eighth. We could be on the verge of the biggest discovery in Gerudo history. Mm. A good place to start would be searching for similar orbs. Maybe it's time to go to Patricia for a prophecy. You should be in the palace courtyard. Ayo, hey there we go. Waggy Pants Granny. I am very well. How are you doing tonight? You know, got off work. Playing some Tears of the Kingdom. Doing good, doing good. So, yeah, I'll end it here and then next time we can... I'll... I don't think I'll take long finding the orbs, to be honest. And, um... And I'll also just make it to Lookout Landing. So. Thank you so much for everyone that watched. Uh, go ahead, please like, subscribe if you enjoyed. I have my Twitter in the bio as well. You can check that out. Peace. <laughs>